Good afternoon everybody. I'm coming back with another video for you guys today. So today we have a Vanguard Grading Troop submission reveal video. I sent in uh, seven cards to get graded. Um, I actually sent them in on, I mailed them out last Thursday, I believe. And today is Friday and um, got them back yesterday, actually. I wasn't able to do a video. So I mailed them on Thursday and got them back on Thursday. So I got them uh, back in seven total days. So lightning fast getting them back to me. I really appreciate it. Um, they threw in some extras that I'm going to share with you guys. And uh, I'm going to use this to remind everybody about the group submission opportunity we have with Vanguard. Um, if we can hit 100 um, cards or more, we can get a group submission for $12 per card in 10 business days. And all I ask is you kick in an extra dollar per card to make it 13 to cover all the fees for shipping and stuff like that. And uh, we can get a group sub and get cards slabbed up in 10 business days um, for dirt cheap. So um, as of right, as it stands right now, um, I am at 60 cards that people have pledged. So with that being said, I'm going to put it out there that if I can get 15 more cards pledged to get to 75, um, I will guarantee the 100 card submission. So I need, I need, I need 15 more cards to be pledged. Um, and that's not just, just to be said that we, we need to count on them. I need 15 more cards that we counted on to get us a 75 and I'll guarantee a hundred. That doesn't mean that you can't submit more cards. I can't mean that other people can't jump in, but, um, if we can get to 75, uh, I will guarantee the hundred, uh, card price and, um, we will try to get as many cards in the submission as possible, as many cards in the submission as possible. So we're still looking to get some more. Um, once hopefully we get to that number, uh, 75 and I can guarantee it, I'll, I'll let you guys know. And hopefully that green lights a bunch more people to jump in on the submission. Um, because I want as many people to take advantage of it as possible. And uh, I think you guys will be happy. So that's where we stand right now. We're at 60. We're close, slowly getting there. And uh, like I said, if we can hit 75, I will guarantee the 100 card price. So that is where we're at. So let us go over this submission from Vanguard. So I did say they threw in some extras, so I'm going to show you those first. Um, first thing that we got was we got a pack of card savers, which is amazing. I am so excited to have gotten these. Um, uh, you don't know, uh, I'm sure you all know how pricey uh, it is. Uh, I know in my area, it can be difficult to even find supplies. So this was an awesome bonus. I really do appreciate it. Um, you cannot go wrong with card savers. So love it, love it, love it. Thank you guys. We'll move that off the side and then Another surprise. I was completely, completely shocked. Um, I'm going to show you the box. So we got a bunch of stands for the graded cards. Perfect way to show them off on your video. So I'm going to take off. I'm going to take out some different versions here. So we have the white version. And as you can see, it's got the Vanguard logo on it. It's got the extra tall arms for additional support. So we have white, and then they threw in gray, and then we also have the nice, clean-looking black. And then they threw in multiples of those, and then we also got, I don't know if I'm having enough room, we also got the, uh, the other version that I've shown you before, which is the more sleek and thinner version. It doesn't have the taller arms, as you can see. It still has a Vanguard logo on it. Um, but I've shown these off before, so I'm going to show those off uh, right now. Now, what I will say is, again, we have a bunch of stands. So um, I'm planning on doing a giveaway because I have slabs to give away. Um, I will include... Uh, some stands with those giveaways. So you guys will get, uh, the winners will get uh, stands as well. So we'll put those out there and we'll use those for our showcase. And moving on to our sub. So I have to say that wasn't the only bonus we got from Vanguard. They definitely hooked it up. So I'm gonna show you guys what else we got. 
So we're going to start off with this awesome Deadpool. It's from uh, 1995, I believe. Let's see here. Oh, 1993 Marvel Masterpieces. You can see the logo there. Let it let it uh, focus. There we go. So this got a 9.0. This card is awesome. Great looking card. Here's the back. You can definitely see the custom logo at its best. I know my phone keeps focusing in and out, but there you go. So we got Deadpool. So these cards that they threw in, um, I'm planning on putting with the other ones that I still have. And we will do, uh, we'll include them in a giveaway, guys. So the next one we got was Joker, the Joker. Look at this. This card just looks great. And you guys got to see this, this uh, label up here. Look at this. This got an 8.5. You can see the Joker on the label. Man, it looks clean. Look at that. Look at that. So that's what we got was we got the Joker. Eight and a half. Put that right there. The next one we got. This has got to be my favorite just because my favorite character is Captain America. This one got an 8.0. But look at that label with the card. I mean, it just, oh man, it just looks so nice. Look at that. Look at that label. So you can see the subgrades there. See 8.0 Mint. It's the uh, old flare from the mid-90s. I loved, I loved the flare sets in the 90s. And you can see the back there. It's got the chest of Captain America right there. Red, white, and blue. Just perfect card right there. We'll put that right there in the case. Or in the stand, I'm sorry. And then the last bonus we got, um, which... Vanguard did not have to do, but it is greatly appreciated. Um, we had a Superman card like this that uh, Alan Twitchell won, and we got another one in. So I know Superman was a popular, popular choice on the giveaway. So we have another Superman card, guys. This one is an 8.5. As you can see right there, 8.5. You can see the subgrades right there, and you can see the big old Superman uh, logo right there from his chest on the label. Flip it around back. You can see kind of the bottom of him ripping open the shirt there. But yeah, so we have another Superman card that we can put in for the give for a giveaway. And that just is amazing. So we'll take Deadpool down and we will put Superman there. So those were the extras, guys. I mean, come on. We got a bunch of stands. We got some top loaders or some card savers, I mean. And we got four cards. I mean, just fantastic. So... Now we're gonna get into what the cards I submitted. So what I submitted first off was this 2020-2021 Panini Mosaic, Jerry West, it's the all-time greats, and it's the Prism version. We got a gem mint on it. Um, the label they chose, uh, I think just goes with the card perfectly. I mean, it just looks fantastic. So we got this Jerry West Prism. Let me show you the back. There you go. So we'll see, uh, we'll see what we can do as far as sales on this card. Um, some of these cards are going to be for sale. Some of these cards are for the collection. So Jerry West came back, a 9.5. Definitely happy with that. Our next card is this 2020-21 Panini Mosaic, and it's LeBron James. It's a national pride. Um, thing I like about this card is I like how it has the USA colors of the flag in the background there. This got a 9 mint. Uh, really, the, the thing that hurt it the most was the surface. Um, but Mosaic can be touchy. I did try to clean it the best I could. Um, this card uh, will also be up uh, for sale. See what we can do with it. With this order, I tried to mix things up again a little bit. So... We'll see how that we'll see how it goes. Um, the next card we got is the 1992-93 Fleer Ultra Shaquille O'Neal rookie. This was a iconic and classic for us that were collecting cards heavy in the early 90s. And uh, this got an eight and a half, which is actually not too bad. Um, surface again, surface and corners. I know the corners were a little soft. 
Um, but eight and a half is a pretty good grade, I gotta say. For the Shaquille O'Neal rookie, there you go. And again, the label choice I thought was fantastic. So we gotta, we're taking Superman down and replacing him with Superman, as Shaquille O'Neal always called himself. So we got Shaquille right there. The next card we submitted was this 2019 Lick Lick Licka Licky uh, Reverse Hollow. It was from Unbroken Bonds. Uh, we were able to get a gem mint on it. You can see on the label they have Lick Licka Licky up there, and uh, we were able to get a nine and a half, nine and a half, nine and a half, and nine. So surface was a little off with the nine. There's the back of the card. But uh, definitely liked how the uh, reverse hollow turned out, slabbed up. Um, this one will uh, will also be up for sale. We'll see what we can do with that one. The next one. So as you guys, uh, if you guys recall from my last video, uh, I have the Season 5 uh, Walking Dead set complete. So I'm going to slowly try to get it graded. The entire set and so uh, I threw in some of the cards from that set so this is a card number five reunited this got a gem mint uh, as you can see um, surface was a little off unfortunately but uh, we still got the gem there's the back of the card and definitely like how the uh, walking dead walking dead cards turn out uh, slabbed up they look really nice so season five right there uh, these Walking Dead ones, of course, are not for sale because they're a part of the set. The next one we got is card number four, and it's Escape from Terminus. This one got a nine mint. And if you can see up there, we got a ten for centering, and then the rest subgrades were nines. So it is definitely a solid, solid nine. And uh, there's Glenn there from season five. There's the back of the card. Glad to get another card slab. So after this, after this uh, submission, I'll I have five of the hundred cards of this set slabbed. Hopefully, on the bulk submission, I'll be sending in quite a bit more. This is card number three. It's uh, nobody's got to die today. We got a gem on this one. As you can see, the subs are all nine and a halfs with one nine. And again, card turned out sweet. Really like how it turned out. Looks good. There's the back of the card, and there you go. So that is my submission. That is what we submitted and got back in one week. From leaving my hand to getting back to my hand took a total of one week, guys. Um, now, I will say I'm pretty fortunate in that uh, VGT is located in Southern California here, so they're not that far from me, but with that said, if you wanted to add on another day or two, you'd still would have gotten it in less than 10 days. It's just amazing. So again, guys, really think about hard about if you want to do the group submission or not. I need another 15 cards guaranteed, and then I will guarantee the 100 card price. And that way we can start um, sending in everything we want to send in, and I can put a huge order together, and we can all get some fantastic slabs coming back. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys think hard about joining the group submission. Really appreciate your guys' time. As always, I hope you guys have a blessed evening. Until our next video.